what's going on y'all carolina shore fishing here and it's time to do some plugging off the pier so let's get to it make sure you guys check out carolinashorefishing.com check out our sponsors shrimp boys co out of south carolina that make fishing related apparel use my promo code csf15 for 15 percent off and I'll check out our second sponsor, Salty Sandals, down in Surfside, South Carolina. If you're in need of some sandals, head there. Sorry there's no audio on this video again, you guys. All of the microphones on my GoPros have gone out, unfortunately. But it is what it is. I'm getting my gotcha lure tied up here. I'm using a 17-pound fluorocarbon leader. I use about 16 to 18 inches of that and I tie it on with an Albright knot. It's been really good to me so far. I use it for drum fishing as well. And you can see I added some Procure, the Menhaden flavor, onto my gotcha. I figured some of those fish that chase it but don't actually commit might actually be enticed to commit with that added scent there. You'll see here, I fish my gotcha lure a couple of different ways, either walking it on the top like it's intended to, or letting it sink down below and popping it off the bottom. I actually get bit off right here must have been a bigger blue or bigger Spanish you'll see how frayed up the leader is when I bring it back in here and you can see where those teeth got it but I actually ended up picking up just a couple of blues and a Spanish for myself I was really down there to get an Atlantic Bonita they were pushing the beaches and it was really awesome to see I hope you guys enjoy the footage that come out of this and uh, make sure to leave a comment and like and subscribe and enjoy the video. I of course had to hook into Carolina's finest fish, the lizard fish. Oh yeah. There's been nothing more exhilarating from the pier than watching these bonito work the bait and the birds following along with them, picking them off as well. It was an absolute thrill.
Thank you.